Hello everyone, this is Juan Sarmiento and today is Wednesday, November the 13th. Okay, here are my trades. Uh, you can expand this position effect and you can see it says some to open, some to close. Let's take a look at the ones to open. We have VLO, analyze trade, and this is my current trade. And that's our current position. We have a little bit of a profit, practically nothing. Take a look at the chart. Okay, that looks good. Let's look at PE. And you remember that we had a loser on this stock. That's okay, that shouldn't matter because if we fail to call the top before, it could the possibility of it going down increases, doesn't it, so to speak. So you shouldn't be influenced by what happened before. Each new trade is a, is a standing trade of its own. Okay, let me see. Uh, just click on the plus and that tells you what the current position is. PNL from the opening. Let me delete this. And that's what it looks like right now. Yeah, that's where, right here where we are. So no uh, profit yet. Doesn't matter, it's just so early. AMAT, analyze trade. Here's where we are. I think AMAT is due to report earnings tomorrow after the close. Okay, so there's a chance that the stock will continue to go higher and that's all right. We have plenty of time before that uh, stock that trade expires so what i'm looking for is a big drop right after earnings and we close the trade very early great but if it goes up we have plenty of time for it to work its way up there and then come back down all right so then the la last is ntap which reported earnings today after the close let's go to the account statement and I'm going to go back, I don't know, 60 days. That should tell, show me the original trade. It was in diagonal, and then we just closed it. And uh, we invested $302 and got, got out 485 Let's take a look. So my profit is $183. And after the earnings, what happens with the diagonals after earnings is that the volatility collapses. Look at the volatility on those options, very high. So the volatility collapses and then we, you end up with a loser. We'll demonstrate that tomorrow. I'm gonna keep this and hopefully I'll remember tomorrow so that you would see whether it was a good idea to get out or not. If volatility collapses, this stock, this trade who looks to be a, seems to be a winner may turn into a loser because it's a diagonal over earnings. Okay, and uh, so those are the four trades. For today, I have one trade on COF. COF, let me see how I start looking yeah i want to trade that and once again we have uh, 336 dollars to make 446 is a little over one percent not too much though that's the trade today and it is a 95 97.5 put spread and it is bearish and it's a long put spread. If you want to find out why I use a put spread in or a call spread in a situation like this, um, think about taking the course. I have not finished the course, but this will be coming. Okay, so create duplicate, confirm and send. And the other trade that is UNP, UNP. 
here it is Union Pacific Corporation Okay, so let's take a look. That's my trade. I'm risking 254 to make 246. The probability is high. Two hundred and fifty to make two hundred and fifty. Okay. Okay. And now you you probably are thinking we have quite a few, perhaps too many bearish trades. So um, compared to my bullish trades. I'm gonna, you can easily move to the group, bearish. And you would see that uh, we have only a handful of bullish trades and quite a few bearish trades. So I think I wanna slow down uh, on the bullish, bullish, on the bearish side. It may well be that the market is telling us precisely that that the market is about to reverse and this is why I find it hard to find any bullish trades or it may be that I'm just overextended on the bearish side so be cautious about that too I need to be cautious we don't want to end up with a bull market that never ends and we lose all of our money right anyway there is a risk on everything and so that's all for today. We'll be back with you tomorrow. See, see you later. Bye-bye. Thank you for joining me for this video. Please be sure to subscribe to this channel by clicking on the subscribe button below. Once you have done that, be sure to also click on the bell so you get a notification of future videos coming up in this channel. Be sure also to click like if you enjoyed this video and feel free to share it with your friends and family. Thank you very much. Don't forget to visit www.putgoldgenie.com Then go and subscribe. You could simply subscribe as a visitor. It is free and you would have access to several videos of interest for traders you would be directed to this registration page. It is free. Once you have subscribed as a visitor, feel free to go to the tutorials and select the free videos. These are videos of general interest for all traders. Thank you very much.